Hey guys, I'm Leon Washington, the New York Jets. Welcome to my beautiful hometown, Jacksonville, Florida. Right now, we're here at Andrew Jackson High School, home of the Tigers, here in Jacksonville, Florida, class 2002. Right now, we're gonna go inside and holler at Coach um, Kevin Sullivan, and he can tell you guys more about the part one of legend. How you doing? Good to see you. Right. the man right here, guys. He is the man. PWL. <laughs> but we called him Pop Warner Legend because he didn't play in 10th grade. Came back out and uh, touched the ball the first time, went 99 yards. So we figured he was pretty good then. So we gave him the ball a bunch. PWL, Pop Warner Legend. His notoriety and the success that we had on and off the field has really transcended our program since uh, the spring of 99. And then that's the jersey, of course, that, uh, that we retired his uh, senior year at Florida State because we knew he was gonna keep going to bigger and better things. Now we're in the old high school locker room. Uh, brings back a lot of memories, and also the smell. Uh, you know, guys kind of keep it kind of folky here in high school. You know, playing Reball in year 2000, you know, guys like Laverne's Coles went to that school, and. It's our rivals and Reigns High School, guys like Leo Shepard, Brian Dawkins, and all those guys went there. So, you know, playing just a lot of those schools and having a chance to, uh, you know, extra stone in history. And I love Jackson football, I love the Tigers football, and, uh, you know, that's what it's about in here in this locker room. Okay, right now here, guys, we're at Tiger Stadium, better known as Nightmare on Main Street. Whenever we're going to practice, we hit the sign, and whenever we're walking by the sign, you know, simultaneously you hit the sign. They've been doing that for a long time here on this football field. I grew up right here, man. My mom had six kids, and a lot of my friends stay in these same apartments. We call them Jesse Street Apartments. You know, it's kind of uptown, east side of Jacksonville, you know what I'm saying? So, uh, where I grew up in. Now these little small football fields right here, man. A lot of my moves I learned now is why, uh, you know, I perfect them here. I mean, we had a game called Hot Ball. It's like 10 people trying to tackle one person. This field right here is where it went down there, right here, man. I don't see kids playing Hot Ball no more like they used to. It's the man right here now. He could have still been in this environment, but he chose that he wanted to get out. And I think he likes sharing that with these kids and sharing it with other individuals. I had people do things for me when I was growing up. I wanted to give back, so I started coaching Pop Warner football. And I told him, I don't care. Don't forget where you came from. If you can reach back and grab just one kid, just one kid, and pull him up, then you've really been successful. Well guys, you know, we're back uh, where I grew up here in high school on East 16th Street. That's where I grew up here in Jacksonville. And I spent my teenage years, you know, my tougher years of my life, you know, get my discipline at my grandma's house with my grandma and granddad. And I still got some things in here from high school. Let's see what this is right here. This is Powell football in 95, so low league football and some of the things I had uh, at Florida State, most valuable player on offense in 03. Stuff like that helps me remember. And so my nephews and nieces come over here. So they can see stuff like this and they can see, you know, what their uncle and or their, or their uh, older cousin did when he was in high school. And this is a sticker that uh, I put on my door. Uh, when I took a visit to Florida State, so uh, I'm a Seminole all the way, contrary to a lot of Gators in Jacksonville, so. How you doing? I'm good. You doing all right? I'm good. Good. Okay, good. Man, just <laughs> love my life right here. Took care of so much. My mom, my sis, kids, uh, you know, everything that I look forward to, everything I look back, uh, she's my motivation. She was so hard on me in high school, I'm telling you. You know, without her and our family, man. I promise you, you know, I probably won't be where it is now, so. Thank you. He's a good, good inspiration on the family, you know. Everybody want to be like Leon now. The main thing I try to realize, what my grandma taught me, it's not only about football. Mm -hmm. It's about, you know, doing things the positive way and, and making the best out of your life and, and make, doing the best you could because we don't take advantage of your talent. It's kind of like a saying, we don't take advantage of what God giving you. So I try to take the most advantage of my talent and, you know, and try to do things the right way and try to be positive because there's always somebody watching me. Mm -hmm. 